Do you want to know the real difference between living in San Diego and San Francisco? I've actually spent time living in both, so I'm excited to break it down for you so you can really know what to expect when living in one versus the other. My name is Dan Parker. I'm the San Diego real estate guy, and I help people from all over the U.S. buy and sell homes right here in San Diego. So if that's helpful for you, consider subscribing to my channel or reach out. Shoot me a message. Shoot me a, a call, text, email. Instagram message, it doesn't matter. I'm happy to start a conversation and help you figure out what you need to know before the big move. So back in 2012, my wife and I got married right here in San Diego, which is where we met, San Diego State University. We got married in 2012 and you know what? We weren't ready to settle down or, or anything like that. We just wanted to travel, we wanted to enjoy life. So we moved to one of our favorite cities. We moved to San Francisco. We moved up there, we lived up there for just about three years. And then we eventually end up moving back. And that was kind of the plan all along, but I'm excited to share with you the reasons that we love San Francisco, which we do. It's still absolutely one of our top favorite cities in the whole US of A. Uh, but I also wanna tell you exactly the reasons why we end up moving out of San Francisco. So if you're ready, let's get started. All right, if you're not very great with geography, San Francisco is located in Northern California. Uh, if you look at it on a map, it's kind of like mid to Northern California, but it's considered Northern California or NorCal. San Diego could not be any more far south as far as California is concerned. It's, it's, it lines up with the border of Mexico. So you have, uh, well, we're gonna talk about all the differences between the two, but let's just start off with that. And these two places are a little bit unique to compare because San Francisco is actually technically uh, a city and a county. So it's seven square miles that you have. And San Diego, there is a San Diego County, which is a large area. And then you have the city of San Diego. So what, what I'm gonna do mostly is I'm gonna compare the city of San Diego versus San Francisco. And just starting off with population, you have 1.42 million people living in the city of San Diego, whereas you have 882,000 people living in San Francisco. Now, surface area, there's, there's a lot more square footage to uh, the city of San Diego than San Francisco. Like I mentioned, San Francisco is seven square miles and it's very dense. You have a lot of tall buildings, um, skyscrapers, and the great thing about that is it's actually really easy to get around. The public transportation is phenomenal. In fact, for the first year and a half that we lived in San Francisco, we didn't even own a car. And when you compare that to the city of San Diego, the city of San Diego is, it's, you know, it encompasses downtown San Diego and then it kind of branches out. And you can, it's somewhat easy to get around in the city of San Diego, especially compared to the San Diego County, but it still is not even close to as dense as it is in San Francisco. And the public transportation is not near as good. There's no question. San Francisco absolutely wins when it comes to public transportation. I would basically say, if you're living in San Diego, you're gonna need a car. It's, there are very few circumstances where you can get away without having a car. You need to be able to get around because everything's so spread out. And since we have a lot to talk about right now, I'm gonna go ahead and rapid fire these next um, comparisons for you so that we can get through this list and you can get a really good sense of what San Francisco versus San Diego is really like. And we're gonna start off with weather. And there's no question, San Diego wins. San Diego wins with weather. It's closer to the equator, it's warmer, it's more mild all year round. Um, there are there's so many 70 degree days in San Diego. And if you compare that to San Francisco, one of the things I actually kind of enjoyed was you, you almost always wake up and you have that chilly morning to just kind of help you wake up when you walk out of your house. But I also remember in San Francisco, you can never really leave your house without a jacket. Even if it feels really, really great out, it doesn't matter. At a certain point in the day, you're gonna need or want to grab for that jacket because the temperature can change so quickly. It changes so quickly, in fact, that there's, there's fog all over the place. The locals have come up with a name for the fog. It's Carl, Carl the Fog. You can follow him on Instagram and Twitter. And next up is entertainment in San Francisco. Absolutely gets a win on this. I mean, they have a stadium for sports teams, uh, music venues, theaters, bars, clubs. There's so much you can do up there. And that is definitely one of the things that we miss. And one of the things we took the most advantage of when we lived up there, just going around and experiencing the city. There's so much to do. And again, the ease of transportation also makes it really, really easy to get around and enjoy your time. And I will say when we first moved up to San Francisco, the food up there, I think was just significantly better. There wasn't much in San Diego that compared to San Francisco, but San Diego has really been catching up in the last 10 years or so. A lot of celebrity chefs have been opening up restaurants. There's a couple of restaurant groups that just have really beautiful restaurants with really high-end chefs. And 
The experience down here is getting so much better, but San Francisco, you still get the win on this one. And next up is cost of living, which San Diego gets the win on because it is cheaper to live in San Diego than San Francisco. Now think about it. San Francisco is this big, dense city. Real estate is really, really, really expensive there. Real estate in California is expensive, but it's extremely expensive in San Francisco. And don't forget you have Silicon Valley up there with big tech and venture capitalists. There's a lot of money getting thrown around in San Francisco. And let's take a look at housing prices. It's almost twice as expensive to buy a house in San Francisco at around $1.4 million is the median home for San Diego, which just hit $700,000, which is still very high, but there's no comparison. It is way more expensive to own a home in San Francisco. Next up, we have transportation. I'm gonna give a slight advantage to San Francisco. Now, like I mentioned before, public transportation is phenomenal and there's no question it, it blows San Diego out of the water on public transportation. You have the BART, you have Muni, you have um, a, a ton of bike lanes, you have um, everything's close proximity because you only have seven square miles. So you can pretty much walk everywhere, but it is extremely hilly and it's not great for cars. It's really challenging for cars if you need to get around driving. So that's why I'm gonna give it a little bit of, of a knockback because in San Diego, there's no problem. You can get around and park just around anywhere in San Diego. Now parking is so tough in San Francisco. I remember my most liked photo in Facebook of 2013 was a park job that I had that just had about, I don't know, an inch on the front, an inch on the back. So which is better to live in, San Diego or San Francisco? Well. I scored it a tie and I did that intentionally because it really depends. It depends what you're looking for. For the lifestyle that we wanted when we moved to San Francisco, San Francisco was better and we enjoyed it thoroughly. But we always knew eventually we wanted to quote unquote settle down. We wanted to buy a house. And in San Francisco, we would have had to have moved pretty far out into the suburbs to be able to afford a house, which is not what we wanted. That's not the lifestyle that we wanted when we were living up there. So we moved back to San Diego and it was a great decision for us and for our family. Now, if you've been to both San Diego and San Francisco, let me know, I'm curious, where would you rather live between the two and why? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy this video, all I ask is if you could just hit that like button down there or subscribe to my channel so you're notified when new videos pop up. I really appreciate you watching this. If you have any questions on moving to San Diego, I'm your guy. Shoot me a message, call, text, email, I'm happy to chat. Thanks so much for watching this video. We'll see you next time.